Well, our uh, Duck Creek Land Care Community Group, it was awarded one of the uh, Land Care Illawarra Awards. And this was our award. It was actually um, handmade by a local Aboriginal uh, artist, and it's a digging stick, so it's very symbolic. Uh, it was actually used as a digging stick as part of our, I guess, symbolic first step to planting. The Duck Creek uh, Catchment Community Group, which is a land care, incorporated land care group, um, we really came about because of uh, Yalla TAFE and David Brookfield working with a local group of um, Aboriginals uh, doing planting within our catchment. Because they wanted to work on private land, we needed a land care group. And a group of landowners, about 35 of us, got together down at the Marshall Mount Hall and thought that was a good idea. So we actually established the group. I think we're really lucky to have Duck Creek at, uh, and the valley. It uh, extends from the escarpment uh, through some of our uh, older farmland, future residential areas. Um, comes out at uh, Lake Illawarra, just near the old Talawarra power station. One of our uh, most successful uh, activities was actually on uh, David and Judy Ball's place, which is uh, just on the corner of Marshall Mount Road and North Marshall Mount Road. And it was to uh, fence out a dam, or two dams actually, Plant, put some planting around that and, uh, and then exclude the stock and, and put uh, a stock watering system outside of the dam. The dam was very muddy, very uh, pugged up and uh, it wasn't long after we actually completed the fencing work and the planting that we, we uh, there was a real improvement in the water quality. I mean David was very impressed. I think in the future as they as we get more people around Dapto and, and Marshall Mount, um, I think they'll start to realise the value of those little open spaces that are left and that they will start to be prepared to put more effort into those and um, plant some of our local native species and, and all of those, those plantings will help us maintain or improve that water quality that's going into that lake and into that wetland. Quite often you don't see things that uh, as value unless, uh, until you lose them. The thing that I saw that was a real benefit was this breathing space between uh, the city of Wollongong and the city of Shell Harbour. You know, just that, that breath, that blink, if you like, when you move from one urban area to the next. I think the future, what I see is I'd like future to look back at us and say that they put some wisdom and thought into what they did at the time and, um, and left us a, a great legacy.